to another time on television. Welcome to Jaffe Fidelis TV. It's my prayer that today's program will be a blessing to you. I started a series of breaking the siege of sicknesses. Now, listing the longevity of a problem is not a problem to divinity. No matter how long you have been sick, God has your healing with him. And today, our mission is to bring that healing to your life. I'm here today on television with my wife, and her name is Janet Fidelis. Welcome to television program today. And she's going to be reading a, a, a scripture with us and for us. And she's going to be praying for the sick. And together we are believing God that the siege of every sickness shall be healed. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Uh, today on the show we'll be reading from Luke chapter 13 from 11. And behold, there was a woman which had a spirit of infirmity 18 years wow. and was bowed down together and could no wise lift up herself. And when Jesus saw her, he called her to him and said unto her, Woman, thou art loose from thy infirmity. Praise the Lord. And he laid hands on her and immediately. Wow. was made straight and glorified God. So the longevity, this woman has been there for 18 good years. Wow. The longevity of her infirmity was not a problem for God. Hallelujah. Immediately Christ laid hands on her. This woman was loose and she was set free. So maybe you are here and you have been going through a sickness or infirmity or an affliction in your body and it has taken long. The longevity is not a problem to God, it's not a problem to the kingdom of God. Wow. The word of God can handle it. So we declare the word of healing to you today. Amen. Be loose in the name of Jesus. Amen. Be set free from that affliction. Amen. Be set free from your for your infirmity. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. You are healed in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. The Bible said Jesus called her to himself, said, Woman. Thou art loose from your infirmity. We decree in agreement that you are loose from your infirmity. Amen. We command the sickness that has held you down to be broken off your heart, off your life. We command that siege of sickness to be destroyed. And we decree you are loose from your infirmity. Amen. Say the amen louder. Amen. Amen. Now listen, if you pray that prayer, you have not given your life to Jesus. I would not like to close, close this broadcast without not giving you the opportunity to give your life to Jesus. You can just pray this prayer after me. You can say, Jesus, today I come. Thank you because you have me in mind. Forgive my sins. Write my name in the book of life. And I decree, according to your word, I am saved. We pray that prayer, congratulation. You are born again. The siege of the devil cannot hold you. Now call those numbers for partnership, for sponsorship, for counseling and prayer. Or write us an email and tell us what God has done for you. And we are waiting to hear your testimony. Or call in so that we can pray with you. Or somebody that is sick around you. Call them, put them on the line. Let the siege of sickness be broken in their life. Don't forget to come to you the way next time. Don't forget, every, every day, day is a healing day. Hallelujah.